Good morning, Sky Divas um, and Fly Guys. I hope everyone is doing well. I haven't made a video in a while. I've been kind of getting used to getting back into the swing of work and everything. I just wanted to do a little short video. Shout out, congratulations to all um, to all the current flight attendants who, or new flight attendants who recently graduated. Congratulations, good luck on your IOEs um, and finding crash pads and just getting acclimated and settled into your new career. Um, to everyone else who are awaiting CJOs and are going off to training with this new virus that's going around, it has really shook our industry right now. Um, I don't know how accurate this information is that I received today that I saw. I tried to go on the website and look it up, but apparently, and this is a rumor allegedly because I have not physically read it with my own two eyes, um, but that our fly sisters um, with um, Transstate, GoJet, and Compass Airlines are no more. I don't know how true that is. I haven't spoken with either, you know, anyone that is a flight attendant for them. And I tried to go on their website to see if there was any news or updates. And all three websites are down. I'm hoping that it's just temporary. Um, right now with this ban, I knew that tra um, Transstate was going to tentatively go out of business by the end of the year. But with everything that's going on, going on right now in the state that we're in, um, it's possible that it could have been sooner than later. And if that is accurate, there are a lot of flight attendants and pilots and ground crew and you know that are going to be unemployed right now. There are a lot of flight attendants awaiting their CJOs, awaiting training dates. And I have a friend that was awaiting training with Delta and his training date is now um, canceled or temporarily on hold to further notice. Um, right now, with um, our company, we haven't heard anything. The only thing that we heard was that there was going to be a decrease in flying and our current bid period was pushed back till Monday. So we don't have any idea how many um, trips or pairings we will have and we don't know if we're going to be on reserve. We don't know if they're going to have any furloughs or layoffs or um, leaves. Right now, we haven't ha heard anything of regarding um, our airline. Everything is still on board for us. I'm actually on a trip now. I'm on reserve this month and they put one trip on my schedule this weekend. Um, and I'm just thankful that I woke up with a job. I'm thankful that I have my health. Um, my daughter's school was canceled like most. I'm thankful that I have a mother at home who my daughter can stay with to watch her because there are a lot of people who doesn't you know do not have that luxury to have someone stay with their kids for two weeks or three weeks or however long this is going to be my daughter's school so far is a week she's on spring break now and she doesn't go back tentatively till the end of for another week and um yeah, it's sad. It's, it's you know, we take a lot of measures on an aircraft. We stay cleaning, stay washing our hands, um, wearing gloves. Um, I had my flight today only had 17 passengers on it. The airports are empty. I'm sorry, I'm breaking out in hives. But it is a really... Um, rough time right now. It's really tough on a lot of people um, worrying about having to take leaves and leave about pay and then health insurance and just, you know, money to pay your bills. So I'm going to continue to pray for everyone and I'm going to ask you all to keep 
our aviation family in your prayers and that this blows over and doesn't get worse than what it is and hopefully they don't completely shut down the airports altogether. Girls supposed to take a cruise in a couple of weeks now. Corona is messing up my vibe and um, I needed this this trip, this cruise. We were going to St. Martin, San Juan, Puerto Rico, and the Bahamas. Seven nights. <sighs> so far, my cruise line hasn't canceled, but with me not knowing, being able to bid for my April schedule is kind of like uh, a lot going on. So just, you know, keep, keep us in your thoughts and prayers, and hopefully... Our company will be able to continue on with our trainings and get you guys in the air with us and this will blow over I I wasn't I didn't get a chance to war I wasn't working as a flight attendant when 9-11 happened so I don't know um, how long it lasted and in the state of the airline industry and how it was impacted um, so this is new for me I'm just grateful that I can log in to my website, to my company's website, and it's still up and running, and they're communicating with us. So I'm just blessed to, as, as of now, still have my job. So with that being said, um, I wish everyone the best of luck and be safe out there, safe travels, keep your family um, and everyone around you safe wash your hands wash your hands wash your hands if you are sick then stay at home don't try to travel and hopefully we all can get through this together so uh, until next time hopefully there is some better news or some you know much much better news than this here and I will keep you all posted. Oh, and if I get to take my cruise, it's actually going to be my second trip ever going anywhere, doing anything. I don't do nothing, but I'll try to take plenty of pictures and videos to share with you guys my experience. All right, take care.